In 2022, Pioneer DJ released the DDJ Rev series, introducing the world to a battle style layout in DJ controllers, bridging together the turntable user and the controller DJ. The DDJ Rev 7 brought motorized jogs and a battle style mixer section, while the DDJ Rev 1's small and compact form brought the feel and layout to the Scratch DJ just starting out. Today, Pioneer DJ introduces a new unit to the Rev series. Hello everyone, I'm Priyon Joni from Pioneer DJ and I'm here to show you the brand new DDJ Rev 5 Scratch Style 2 Channel Performance DJ Controller. As the newest addition to the Rev line, the Rev 5 fills the gap between the Rev 7 and the Rev 1, providing exceptional DJing and offering an authentic Scratch experience with a variety of innovative features enabling more creative and open format DJ performances. The DDJ Rev 5 continues the popular battle style layout sporting a large CDJ style jog wheel along with the S series style mixer layout. The Rev 5 features dedicated controls for stem separation along with a new auto BPM transition feature. It also allows you to get musical with the new piano play feature. Not only is the Rev 5 supported by Serato DJ Pro, but it's also the first DJ controller in the Rev series that is officially compatible with Rekordbox and unlocks performance mode for free. The DDJ Rev 5 fits the needs of different DJs, especially those who likes to use CDJs with a battle mixer, or DJs who like to go back and forth between turntables and a DJ controller. The battle style layout brings them closer to home without compromising the muscle memory of using turntables. Many of the design cues were inherited from the DDJ Rev 7, but with a unique shape that reduces nicks and scratches on the corners while making it ergonomic to transport. The long tempo slider of the Rev 5 sit horizontally above the deck section, just like a turntable rotated 90 degrees in battle style. That also includes the play pause button on the lower right corner of the jog wheel under the small current cue button. The large CDJ style jog wheel combined with the latest generation Magval fader lets you scratch, battle, and perform intuitively with the Rev 5. Just like on CDJs, you can adjust the tension of the jogs with the feeling adjust knob while being able to mix and cut with ease with the Magval fader. Performance pads and lever effects are placed on the mixer section for control of performative functions. You can combine up to six Serato effects together. You can let your creativity run wild to create blends and live mashups using the four dedicated stem buttons. Each button corresponds to one of the four stems in Serato DJ Pro, while melody and bass are combined for the three-part separation in Rekordbox. You can also use these stem buttons as four secondary pads similar to the Rev 7. The Rev 5 features stem level, which allows you to adjust the volume for each separate stem using the EQ knobs. You can toggle the control by holding shift and clicking one of the two headphone cue buttons. With stem move, you can easily move stems between different decks simply by holding the stem button and clicking the stem you want to grab from the other deck. The Rev 5 is capable of playing four decks, which you can toggle with the deck select button. When combined with Serato stems and stem move, you can play different stem parts on each deck, then lock your mashup and control it using dual deck like it was one song. Having stems on different decks also allows you to apply EQ or effects to different stems independently. As it's known with open format mixing, sometimes you have huge jumps in tempo between songs, and often you don't have the perfect transition track to do it with. With the new auto BPM transition, you can automate the transition with any track. You can choose the number of bars for the transition by holding shift and clicking the select button. There's one, two, four, and eight bars. And when you press play on the auto BPM transition, the track that is playing will gradually change tempo to match the track that's loaded on the other deck. So this track is at 126 BPM and I wanna to transition to the next track that's 71 BPM and I wanna do it over two bars. So I'm gonna hold shift, select two, and here we go.
You can also set the stem, auto loop, and key lock control to be applied during the transition, freeing up your hands to control other creative functions. Piano Play is a new pad mode that takes the space of all 16 performance pads and lays out a selected hot cue in a piano-like configuration across the pads. The notes on the upper parts of the pads are like the black keys on a piano, while the white keys are on the lower part of the pad. When you hold shift, you can select which hot cue you want to use. So I have this piano sample, and I can play it like a piano in Piano Play. You can do this with all sorts of samples in the hot cue. So we have this note, and we're gonna reopen Piano Play, and we're gonna select that hot cue, and now we can play that like a piano. Let's select a different hot cue. You can even choose three different scale types that illuminate the keys. This helps folks with no knowledge of musical theory to play harmonically compatible with the scale with ease. Just like the DJM S11 and DJM S7 mixers, the DDJ Rep 5 features combo pad modes. This allows you to open two primary pad modes at once on the top and bottom of the primary pads. So if I want my hot cue and my sampler combined, I just hold the hot cue pad mode button and click sampler. And now I have my first four pads for hot cue and my first four pads for sampler on the bottom. When used in combination with the pads on the stem buttons, you can essentially have up to three pad modes open on one deck. So I'm gonna combine hot cue and roll. So I have my first four hot cue, my first four roll over here. I have my stems over here, or it could be any other pad mode, which is hot cue, scratch bank, save loop or sampler for these pads. On the rear, you'll find professional inputs and outputs, including balanced XLR master with unbalanced RCA as well as a pair of balanced TRS booth outputs. Two USB Type-C ports allow connection for up to two computers. There is a pair of stereo RCA auxiliary inputs and also two balanced mic inputs, one combo and the other TRS with attenuation control for each. Next to the power button is another USB Type-C port for power. So if you happen to misplace your power supply, you can use any USB Type-C power supply with matching power. The two microphones can be controlled in the front with independent volume control and a shared two-band EQ. Crossfader curve and reverse switch is near the crossfader. There are two headphone outputs of two sizes, one quarter inch, the other eighth inch, with level control and mix beside it. Next to it is the auxiliary volume and toggle switch for line level or boosted for portable devices. With its seamless integration of advanced features, intuitive design, and professional connectivity, the Rev5 empowers you to unleash your creativity in any room. Get ready to revolutionize your performance, ignite the crowd, and captivate your audience with the DJ Rev5 scratch style two channel performance DJ controller for Serato DJ Pro and Rekordbox. If you have any questions, feel free to drop them in the comments down below. If you want to find out more about the DJ Rev5 or see more products from Pioneer DJ, be sure to visit our website, pioneerdj.com, or catch us on our social media channels at Pioneer DJ USA. Thank you for watching.